Hello traders, how are you? Vladimir Rybakov here from Traders Academy Club. This video is the weekly forex analysis and forecast for the week of 5 to 10 April 2020. First of all, I hope you are safe in this uh, crazy period uh, that you're holding and uh, stay, stay strong, stay safe and hopefully things uh, will uh, get better uh, soon to all of us and we will return to life as we know it. To all those of you who watch us for the first time, welcome to our channel and our community. I would like to invite you to subscribe to the channel. Just follow the subscribe button below the video and remember to enable the notifications. As well, I would like to invite you to join our completely free Telegram channel where we share uh, our daily basis all the ideas we have in blog uh, and a trading view and uh, much more uh, valuable content, completely free. And uh, to all those of you who are serious about trading and want the real-time education trading, I would like to invite you to join my live trading rooms where we discuss about all the opportunities, uh, uh, setup after setup, idea after idea, uh, in live trading rooms backed up with trading reports, which I'll show you today how it looks uh, like as well. So welcome to the community. Let's begin. Uh, as always, on Monday, you would uh, receive uh, the... Uh, forecast uh, in a written uh, version just uh, come to the blog vladimirribakov.com and you would find this well this is from previous week <laughs> on monday you will get the updated one of course for the coming week um, so this is the forecast in a written text in a text uh, version uh, scroll down and you will see here all the things i cover in the video uh, explained for you step by step in a uh, written text version as well so it's a very very good uh, one uh, to go and to um, refer to right as a reminder you can you, you will see them here uh, um, clickable for you all the instruments covered and discussed uh, so uh, let's begin the first one we were looking to trade was the euro dollar and the idea that on the last two weeks first of all we wanted to see the abcd and then looking for uh, the sales and then it switched by making three higher highs higher lows and the idea became uh, let's go by, by retraces so let's take a look uh, where the euro dollar uh, came in play here we are making the retraces a b c d but then we never break the trend line and we never yet recreate a bullish momentum and instead of that we are now in bearish trending structure making lower highs and lower lows this is a no-go for me for as you know if you follow me for a while uh, that's a bearish trend pattern which does not fit in the cycle analysis uh, as per divergences and cycle i lost the synchronization and i personally have no read of this um, zigzagging back and forth situation. Uh, everything could uh, happen here and I would not be surprised if we're gonna continue for the new low and I would also not be surprised if we're gonna hit here some long zigzagging range. As for now, uh, I myself have no read here and I removed from the list the idea that I had here failed and I never managed to get a setup and the setup that I wanted to follow uh, let me show you here the euro dollar uh, was looking to buy from this uh, uh, zone this is a trading report uh, as uh, I mentioned before that's what we do in the Traders Academy Club all the trading ideas one after one and this was our basically the setup the break above the falling trend line I wanted to see that as a buy trigger but as I just explained we never managed to get triggered as the trend line was not broken and the ABCD became uh, much further moved down. As for now, I don't see the synchronization of cycles and the trending pattern. This one is removed uh, from the list. Uh, now, uh, the next one on the list is going to be uh, Euro Pound, which starts to be interesting with its price action and the zones. But before... I dig deeper I would like to take this chance and explain you about the little uh, uh, unique from my point of view uh, exclusive 
uh, crisis time opportunity. This is the time where we all stuck in houses and homes, working from home, uh, quarantined in many, many places around the world. That's our time to dedicate as much as possible to education, practice things, learn things, combine things, combine techniques, develop the skills and the techniques. Uh, I have a special offer for all the followers and this offer is lifetime access to the Traders Workshop, my educational center, where you would be exposed to all the possible uh, uh, content you need lifetime. Every new video that is uploaded there, you would get exposed to them. Uh, this is rel relatively new project and um, the educational center. This is where all the educational material would be for lifetime. Uh, uh, organized for you and you would have access to that so especially for this period you get a 50% discount or get it completely free with the brokers program that we have and you also get six free months access to the traders academy club the live trading rooms and a trading report so this is the link you can find it right now on the right top corner of this video just click there or below the video in the description or in the pinned comment you would find this link so just click that and you will be exposed to all the information you will learn here uh, much more about it and this is where you just join it as i said you can enjoy from two amazing uh, options first of all 15 percent discount and six free months or completely free with the brokers program and get the workshop for lifetime and six free months this uh, offer is limited time uh, and it's mainly for this period where people can dedicate themselves to education uh, so uh, if you are interested in that uh, enjoy this offer it's here for a short time I don't know to say limit, it's not going to be a day or two, of course, it's going to be a few weeks, uh, but I don't know to say exactly how long uh, we will uh, keep it up. As for now, it's available, the link, you can enjoy from that. Uh, so uh, let's uh, go and the Euro Pound, what do we have on this pair? Uh, I personally find it very interesting, as here are the levels we currently, oops, sorry, <laughs> wrong uh, measure here this is our euro pound and that's the massive zones we have for this pair so we are in two expanded waves which also could be broken like into little three waves and we are developing here some massive divergence we have a lot of fights on here so we can expect some serious uh, um, fight around these areas now as per the long term are we going to see a buy for new highs here or is it going to be a temporary stoppage before continuation lower? It's too early to judge. There are too many factors uh, around it. But uh, I definitely love the fact that after the ride on the Bollinger Bands more than twice and a 20 candles ride here that almost was completed, we are moving to the opposite bend of the Bollinger's and that the four hour chart suggests classical levels plus expansion of the feebles which fit here in a fantastic cycle zone right here i believe that this area is going to be uh, critical for us for this pair and there are two ways to approach into the trade here so first of all the one that was explained previous week but still wasn't triggered the week was Kind of slow previous week was kind of slow uh, not too many opportunities i found myself um, invalidating many of the views like the euro dollar i showed before right in the euro dollar i was uh, planning to buy above the break of the trend line. never happened it had to be invalidated uh, and a lot of things like that happened previous week it is part of trading we cannot ever force trading we have to follow the facts the market gives us and these facts were invalidations if i always say if the market follows your plan great be there trade it but if the market doesn't and it invalidates the plan then listen to the market do not force your view on the market it's a terrible mistake traders do 
and I hope, I hope you will avoid it because it doesn't make sense, right? The market doesn't care of the line with lines we draw. The market doesn't care of our wishes. The market does what the market has to do, and we have to fit in, not the vice versa. So that's the euro pound. We can trade above the break of the trend line, but as I explained before, I want to see the higher highs, higher lows uh, in the breakout. Okay. Uh, or the second option is to get that into this zone, and we are very, very, very close to this area. And on the lower time frame, in that case, it will be one hour chart to look for this uh, uh, pattern. So we basically can look for higher highs, higher lows, and then retraces and breakouts, for example, uh, and rally, right? Or alternatively, complete false breakouts. Let's say uh, we get one more and then get convergence. Convergence is the place where the indicator and the price follow up each other, higher highs on the chart, higher highs on the indicators, and then look to buy retraces. As I said, I don't know to say if it's going to be long term or short term retraces, uh, but I definitely know I love these uh, areas uh, due to the facts and the factor I, I, I uh, mentioned before. And also quick uh, view in the Forex crystal ball statistics teach us that we are in a massive zone here, as you see also, with high probabilities of um, turning bullish mode and mainly the dates. Look at the dates, three, six, five, very, very strong days for possible uh, buttons. So all the indications are there, but remember, indications remain indications. They cannot change the price. What you need is to see the price changing. The indicators are exactly as the name suggests, indicators. And as much as I love indicators, it's critical to remember indicators are exact, doing exactly what they're supposed to do, indicate that something could go and happen. The price action will be the one that verifies or not your expectations. So that's why uh, I wanted you to uh, understand the logic here behind this uh, trade. EuroCAD, where we enjoyed the sales, one of the scenarios was uh, basically, uh, where is that? No, that's the short term. Uh, let me show you that from the report, one of the scenarios I wanted to follow up. So once again, that's the trading report uh, we have in uh, Traders Academy Club on daily basis. Okay, with all the list of the webinars and of course uh, the watch list, which is separated by instruments and time frames. Basically, just click the image and it opens the image for you with, uh, the, with our plan as a summary to the explanation of the live trading room. Uh, so uh, once again, I invite you to join us uh, there uh, and to enjoy from all these opportunities day after day with me and with Jordan. Uh, just Please, if you expect sort of any holy grails or uh, uh, quick money solutions, don't waste your time, don't waste our time. We are not here to make magic, we are here to trade uh, and uh, follow the market, follow the facts, okay? So if you belong to the category of uh, people that uh, uh, are looking for holy grail solutions, we are not like that and that's the wrong place for you in that case. If you are looking for the real-time education in real-time market conditions, I can I can help you definitely here, but I cannot make any magical solutions for you. So please uh, uh, just ignore if you belong to this category of people, okay? Next one, uh, so the EuroCAD I want to show you, wanted to look for a setup here from this area or uh, from completing of the ABCD. So basically we're looking to get out of the range and go for buys or completing the uh, ABCD and that's what we can see the pair is doing it never managed to get out of the range was stuck inside never built a structure to go up and instead of that completing the ABCD which we face right now it's uh, it has a bullish divergence here on the histogram and it's in a pattern of the triple double which makes me think that this area this is the area where we can start looking for bullish reversals. Now, observing that on the higher time frame, I want to remind you the 
cycle analysis I have here. I don't know if I'm right, but this is the way I approach to that. We are in trending structures on the long-term monthly chart with two waves correction, break of the trend on, and the retest. Uh, weekly had the bullish divergence and the fly to, to create a bullish convergence, which means after it traces, we expect continuation. The daily is the one that has the structure for us and develops a bullish hidden divergence. So this is where the first leg is and a bullish hidden divergence is forming. And the four hour is broken into waves in that case. That's what makes me think that's the zone. So the two ways to approach here uh, for that. The ABCD breakout should be good sign for continuation. The other one more aggressive is like with the Euro pound. When we start to see the false breakout and convergence come in play, then our time. So for example, uh, this is the last place where we have the divergence, okay? And that's the place where we can get the convergence, the convergence uh, principle. Uh, and if we do, that has to be trending structure. And then we can look for buys. If uh, we, we are heading to one more low, we have to remember there has to be divergence and then higher highs on the chart, higher highs on the indicator. Once we see this price behavior, this will be a bit more aggressive approach, but valid approach. Okay, that's the zone, that's the levels. My view is after the ABCD is completing, we start to look for bullish uh, uh, setups. Keep in mind, we're talking here about longer term opportunities. It's not intraday. It's not necessarily going to be fast. It could be uh, slow and more annoying, but that's the uh, uh, direction I'll be focused. From now on next pair on the list was the dollar cad and the idea here was to see this uh, triple wave uh, uh, completing making the retrace and get potentially one more low so we got the three waves it didn't go further for a low it was completed here with this bullish divergence and now here's a big 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 question what's next is it going to be the ABCD pattern here before a continuation or on one more low, or is that a beginning of a new high? As for now, the beginning of the week, personally, I see that a bit in contradiction. According to daily, we are in bullish hidden divergence hitting for a possible rally. According to the four hour, we are in a trending structure that could lead for one more low it's kind of impossible to uh, put the finger on the right time to trade it so as for now it's removed on the and go to neutral in the live trading rooms we are going to follow that and talk about it as it prepares the setup for us so those of you who are in the live trading rooms follow up and stay tuned this pair would be there once we have it clearer uh, uh, prepared for us uh, so the next one was the cat franc where we enjoyed the buys and then we discussed about the uh, sales basically that was our idea but that's from previous week live trading room so i'm not going to duplicate it what i do want to show you is our um, uh, this week uh, interesting uh, setups we were dealing with one of them was the aussie cat aussie uh, kiwi sorry and here is a very interesting thing to pay attention to. Look on the way we want to trade it. Sell the rallies on the daily. Four hour chart to complete ABCD. And the one hour chart, that was our plan. We spot the trending structure and we want to see this done. So Aussie, Ka uh, Aussie Kiwi, why do I confuse it today? Did that exactly. We were looking to approach and complete the ABCD. And on the one hour chart to trade, right? The buys. So we spot that we got a little retrace here, then another retrace with a bullish hidden divergence and the highs created. Uh, then what happens is bearish divergence on the one hour chart, bearish divergence on the four hour chart, uh, which makes me personally think this ABCD was completed 
and likely to assume we are now in a bearish uh, uh, momentum. So as long as this top holds, that will be invalidation for me. I think this pair is going uh, down and I will be focused here on the sales, sell opportunities. Uh, so um, that's one of the trades we traded this week was very good. Other one was the dollar yen, uh, where we want to see the sell, uh, sell the rallies. Another pair that paid beautifully right here basically completed the ABCD with the bearish divergence in the uh, trending structure uh, that we had before breakout and continuation what do we face with dollar yen right now uh, bullish divergence on the one hour chart bullish divergence on the four hour chart that's the place where of course uh, uh, abandon the trades and the uh, cashing out uh, and that's all right now i do not see anything interesting with this pair currently it might pop up during the week so as for now dollar yen goes neutral another interesting trade uh, from our list uh, that uh, we traded uh, this uh, week <coughs> sorry was the cad yen uh, and uh, sell the rallies was our plan here again quick uh, i want to quickly show you how it uh, behaves for us so we got the rallies bearish hidden divergence came in play uh, new low pullbacks and another lows so this pair was also very very good and then again look what happens two false breakouts uh, that uh, come sorry two false breakouts that come in play uh, uh, one two and after that the four hour chart and the one hour chart complete the bullish divergence this is the place where we say thank you mr market right now i would expect as long as this top holds this is my invalidation area i expect that this pair continues down so i am after sales here uh, kadien also very good uh, one that uh, worked nicely for us and we follow so there are many other uh, instruments on the list as you can see i'm not going to cover all of them i just wanted to show you brief examples how and what uh, we do on daily basis in the live trading room once again if you are looking for real-time education covering these setups talking about them uh, and to join um, our live uh, in telegram that's where you would be exposed to all the charts all the discussions everything that we have here day after day once again so just join us in the live trading room follow the link below the video in the description or in the pinned comment we are there for you uh, so uh, scrolling down all the way uh, we also were talking about let's see that the indices and indices it's one of the things i want to cover the idea for the long term is sell and my view remains very bearish here i expect to see continuation so the way that the daily charts currently look like with this hidden divergence hints that the bearish uh, momentum is here and we could see that starting right away or trying to create a new high but with the latest numbers from non-farm payrolls terrible numbers uh with more than seven hundred thousand uh, uh um, job re report uh, here and so many job claims uh jobless claims and the unemployment rate which is increasing dramatically to 4.4 much more than everybody was expecting in 3.8 uh, with such numbers with the coronavirus with the transportation around the globe which is so 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 limited with businesses being closed and shut down or bankrupted i do not see anything uh, uh, too good currently happening here and the only only reasons for rallies would be how much more money would the federal reserve and the other central banks bring into the system which is terrible solution from my point of view um in in that cases it has to go directly uh, to families to businesses and not to the banks which we all know 
uh, how they uh, tend to spend their money. Uh, this has to be a, a, um, accurate and exact help and not just to the uh, big fat banks uh, which will lend the money under bad conditions to people. I, I think this solution is wrong. Of course, I might be wrong, but the way I see that what was good in 2008 with all the bailouts and the quantitative easings, it's not the situation that we all face in 2020. So uh, bearish view is uh, the one that I hold here and we might see that holding and uh, basically com continuing the lows after uh, making uh, the breakout or we can simply tr try to squeeze one more uh, one more high to complete the divergence and then uh, uh, move down. Both scenarios are, uh, are acceptable and uh, uh, logical but and that's it in that uh, um, flow of uh, 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 facts I am bearish here and for me it's only sell the rallies uh, plan so uh, that's uh, what the market gives I uh, would like to ask your support and your help if you find the ideas and the, uh, the video um, helpful educational uh, please uh, leave your feedback below in the comment section. Hit the like button. Your support is very much important to me and the channel. Uh, this video uh, and the forecast that I publish uh, on Monday and the uh, text version are completely free for the community. So feel free to spread the word with anyone you want. The idea here is to help the community with some interesting ideas. I wish they all could work. Of course, they, it's impossible. I'm not making any magic here, as I said before, just following the market and trading it. Uh, so the idea is to help with these ideas, provide some value and quality uh, calls to them and hopefully to, to help. So feel free to spread the word and share it with anyone you want. It's completely free for the community. Uh, and uh, thank you very much for, uh, for your help and your support. And uh, until then, uh, I wish you stay safe, good health. Uh, be responsible for your actions, help to those who need it, and I wish you a fantastic trading week. I'll see you in the live trading rooms uh, in the Traders Academy Club and in the chat. Uh, and uh, meanwhile, stay safe, dedicate your time to education, develop your skills, um, get better. That's the time to do it. We always complain we don't have enough time um, to do things. Well, my dear friends, do not blame time in your decisions. Okay, it's in your hands, it's your decisions, so be responsible for them and then make the right ones. Okay, so uh, stay safe, have a good week, and I'll see you around. Thank you very much for your time watching this video. I hope it was helpful. I'm Vladimir Bekov from Traders Academy Club, and I'll see you soon.